Hello everyone, it's Charles from the Thrifty Deegans, and today is Wednesday, so it's time for another What's Sold video. Alright, we're just going to get right into it. Uh, this will be for the week of the 1st of September to the 7th. So, we'll see what's sold, and uh, as always, that's give or take, depending on, um, you know, if I... Um, catch a couple in from the next week or get a couple from the end of the last week it happens it's just how the videos get recorded all right let's get right into it okay up first we have this pair of aloe pants um these are um some workout pants yoga pants whatever you want to call them um these actually came from a reseller box i believe it was one of the reseller big boxes um so yeah, um, so those would be six dollars. Um, anyway, uh, they sold for forty dollars. Um, that leaves us with eight dollars in posh fees, giving us an earnings of thirty-two dollars. And then with the previously mentioned six-dollar um, cost, that leaves us with a profit of what is it? Twenty-six dollars. Yep, twenty-six dollars. All right, that's a pretty good start to the week. Um, so, you know, I know last week was slow, um, but this week started out good, so um, we're going to hope to turn it around. And full disclosure, I am recording this um, kind of in the middle of the week, so I'll probably do a second part of the video where I'll change costumes and um, we'll see some more stuff. And speaking of more stuff, we have this Jack by BB Dakota um, Jamie overall dress. Uh, okay, that's a that's a mouthful. Um, anyway, this sold for twenty dollars, uh, giving us four dollars in posh fees and sixteen dollars in earnings. Now this came from a consignment store, so um, it was actually a little bit pricier. Um, I do think we still made a profit from it. Uh, according to my notes here, it says it cost us $10, which would leave us with only $6 in profit off of this. Um, so, not really a big sale, but um, I believe this might this might be the last item from that um, consignment store box. So, that closes off a box, which is always, um, always a reason to be happy. It means I get to throw away a box and uh, make some room in our inventory system, which... Um, is behind me there i don't think you can see it um it's getting pretty getting pretty bulky back there so need to need to get rid of some boxes all right up next is this pair of made well high rise wide leg jeans now you may notice that i have a stock photo there and that's because this actually comes from a consignment store box that everything in it was um, new of tags. Um, I think it was all stuff that was um, uh, some kind of like overstock. They sent it off to the consignment store um, inventory thing. Um, I don't know, um, but my wife did get it. Um, it really didn't cost us too much more than, um, well, it cost, it was a, uh, it didn't cost us too much more than normal consignment store boxes, but it was just a, just a tad bit um so let me look at my notes here and we'll go through the numbers all right um this sold for forty dollars um leaving us with eight dollars posh fees we didn't do any kind of discount on it so 32 dollars in earnings it cost us a whopping twenty dollars okay that is a bit that is a little bit more um so we only got twelve dollars in profit but stock photo i didn't have to shoot anything um Basically, my wife just took this box, took everything in it, found stock photos, listed them, and um, we're good. So, really low effort for $12 in profit, um, which is, you know, that's actually pretty good considering how, um, considering that I didn't have to shoot anything. So, it was all, all on Angelique on that one. All right, and up next, we have this Adidas hoodie. Um, this came from one of the um, reseller big boxes. Um, actually, I think it's the reseller big box that will... 
I think it's the one we just got through. Um, so maybe look at last week's videos to see um, to see that. Um, anyway, this was a sold for fifteen dollars, leaving us with three dollars in posh fees, twelve dollars in earnings, and because it's from a reseller big box, um, we sold it for six dollars which leaves us with a profit of six dollars i just gotta update my um chart there because for some reason i had a uh, edit as coming from thread up but it definitely came from a uh, reseller big box i pulled it out we shipped it out today so i know that all right and that's gonna do it for now so i will go ahead and um wait until more stuff sells and then I'll record um, another part of this video and uh, we'll see how we do then. All right, go ahead. All right, it's a little bit later in the week so let's see what else sold. Um, up first we have this Lulu's um, black maxi dress. Um, you know, the Lulu stuff I thought it was oversaturated on Poshmark. Um, I thought it would have some trouble selling, but this actually sold pretty fast. Um, just, I believe, just a little bit outside of our normal three-month window. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to throw it into the three-month window because I don't really know when stuff gets listed. I just know when it gets shot. Okay, so this sold for $28, um, leaving us with $5.60 in posh fees. Posh fees not phase, fees. Um, and we did do um, discounted shipping, so tack off another two twelve on it, and that leaves us with $20.28 in earnings. Now, this came from a reseller big box, um, one of the ones that we just got through, or at least that one of the videos that just went up, so um, sometime within the past two weeks, um, that video went out, and because it's a reseller big box, that's $6. So that leaves us with $14.28 in profit off of this. All right, up next is this Torrid blouse. Um, now this, I think, came from a consignment store. Um, actually, I think it was a consignment store clearance box. Um, so I'm not entirely sure on that box. I think in the past I've said it was $10 a piece on that, uh, but I could be mistaken. Um, but let's look at the numbers. So this sold for $16. Um, we did do, so that leaves us with $3.20 in posh fees. We did the discounted shipping, so that's another $2.12, leaving us with $10.68 earnings. And if it cost us $10, we only made $60 eight cents off of this one so um maybe that's maybe that's right maybe it's not um i don't know i know with some of these items that have been in our closet for a little bit i think this has been in for about five months um my wife will take and just say you know what we'll take it at um we'll sell it at cost just to keep inventory moving um yeah all right and the the last item for now is this C by Chloe Brown Fair Isle sweater. Um, now this sold for, this this was a pretty good sale. It sold for $50, um, so that's $10 in posh fees because they take 20%, um, leaving us with $40 in earnings. Um, and then this came from a uh, thread up box, so that's only $2, only $2 in cost, leaving us with $38 in profit off this. So that's really good. All right. And that's going to do it for now. Um, we'll see if um, anything else sells, um, which it should because it's only, it's only Saturday. So we still have two more days of sales to get. Um, and we'll come back with uh, those future sales and the numbers. All right. I'll kick it over to myself in the all right two more things sold so we're going to go through those and then we'll go through the totals so up first is this pair of j crew slim pants um these were my size so i'm a little disappointed they sold um but there's still a couple more pairs um from that 
box that are my size so maybe I'll get something new out of it all right these sold for $20 um, leaving us $4 of Poshmark fees no discounted shipping um, so that was $16 in earnings now they came from a big um, I believe it was a big fashion about trash box so they would have only cost us about six dollars leaving us with a profit of ten dollars and up next we have this decode dress oh um, no this was this was from an old thread up box um, yeah don't know if i actually even did a video on that box huh. um anyway this also sold for twenty dollars leaving us with four dollars in posh fees yet again uh, we did no discount so once again we find ourselves with sixteen dollars in earnings now because this was from a thread box uh, the profit is different this only cost us two dollars so we had fourteen dollars in profit all right um, and that takes care of everything that sold this week um all run the numbers and come back with totals in a little bit all right back with the totals okay so this week we sold a total of 249 dollars worth of sales we had 49.80 in uh, poshmark fees and we only had two items um that we discounted so we only had four dollars and 24 cents in um discounted shipping uh, that leaves us with $194.96 in earnings and based on where things came from um, we had about $68 in cost and that leaves us with $126.96 in profit so a little bit better than last week um, still not up to those numbers we were seeing a few weeks ago but um, we're we're starting to get there um, now we did have one mistake from last week. Uh, the previous week I had sent out a bundle of um, of shirts. However, one of the shirts I um, I sent out the wrong shirt. Um, the box had a crop top and a V-neck in it. I grabbed the V-neck and it was the crop top that sold. Um, so that was um, that was my mistake. Um, we ended up, we just, um, sent out the, uh, we sent out the other shirt to the, um, to the buyer. So they got an extra shirt out of the deal and we had to pay for the, uh, shipping, which was only like five bucks. Um, so not a huge loss, but, um, mistakes continue to happen, but that's from last week, not from this week. So this week we, um, we did pretty good. Um, no, no mistakes. So. Hopefully we can keep that trend going for next week. All right, now let's go ahead and see what's coming up this week as far as videos go. <clears throat> okay, oh, excuse me, I'm gonna... Ooh, that's hot. Sorry, I'm recording this uh, early in the morning before everybody wakes up. Um, so, trying, trying something new there. Normally I'd record during nap time. Because naps are important for, not for me. I don't sleep. Uh, all right. So we just, looks like we're going through another 50 item reseller box. Um, so that, let's see. Looks like we did part two yesterday. We're going to do part three tomorrow. And then we have next week we got a $60 thread up box um, coming out so that'll be on Tuesday and Thursday and then of course we'll have the what sold video coming out on Wednesday and then it looks like looks like I gotta get um looks like I gotta get more videos edited and put up because I don't have anything scheduled for after that huh. okay so that's gonna do it for this week now before i go i do want to give one shout out to our latest subscriber um our latest subscriber is angie resells um and let me 
I need to put some picture over there. Um, or is it over there? I forget where my I forget where my face is on these videos. Um, anyway, she is, of course, um, as the name suggests, a reseller named Angie. Um, and she's actually been in this for a lot longer than we have, and um, is actually making a lot, lot more sales than um, than we do. Uh, so she mostly does um, sales on eBay, and it looks like she just came back from a pretty, um, from about like a four or five month hiatus. So uh, welcome back, Abby. Um, keep making videos um, and keep watching ours. All right, if you enjoyed these videos, be sure to like, share, and comment. Um, and if you do are a new subscriber, um, be sure to let me know and I'll um, give you a shout out. Until next time, I'm Charles, and I'll see you.